When I was designing my practice in 2003, I asked myself several important questions. One of them was, who are my patients? Well, they're families and individuals, young families with young children, single parents, couples without children, middle-aged couples with college age or grown children, domestic partners, LGBTQ or straight, retired couples, elderly widows and widowers. They're black, white, Latino, Asian, multiracial, or whatever. My patients are dynamic, interested, creative, and curious people. They're artists, students, entrepreneurs, teachers, professionals, scientists, and activists. They come to see me at least once a year for a health maintenance and improvement visit. They want to know what's new in medicine and what I think about it. They undertake screening and prevention measures as I recommend, such as immunizations, mammograms, and colonoscopies. They read things they want to ask me about. They value my opinions and trust me. They are always willing to hear what I have to say and value my forthrightness and my patience. They don't fear to come back and see me if I've given them a suggestion and they've not been able to take it or maintain a lifestyle change as we had hoped. My patients are respectful of me and of my staff. They are respectful of my time and my privacy. They are appreciative of my commitment to my work and my efforts on their behalf. They really appreciate that I call them back promptly when they leave a message. And then I call them with test results, even when the results are normal. They trust the referrals I make to specialist colleagues and follow through when referred. They don't call me about very minor ailments, such as colds. They do expect to be seen the same day when necessary and in a reasonably short amount of time for less urgent matters, in days, not weeks or months. They sometimes request that I make home visits or visit them at their place of work, which I will gladly do. My patients generally have and are willing to allocate sufficient financial resources to get the best health care available. Health is a priority for them as they understand that sound health, both physical and emotional, is the foundation for success and happiness in their lives. My patients gladly pay an annual fee to secure their place in my practice and make payment in full at the time of service for services rendered. I also donate a portion of my services to those in need. My patients like to laugh with me. They appreciate a funny Halloween costume I may wear to the office, on Halloween of course. Conversely, they are very comfortable crying in my presence as well. They frequently confide in me. In addition, they ask me about my life, about my family and my relationships. They may invite me to important occasions in their lives or to attend performances, premieres, or events in which they play a part. My patients are interested in improving themselves, their community, and the world, as am I.